Yo, what's going on guys? I have a very quick and short war video for you today. Currently right now, it is Thursday night. And this weekend, I'm going to the lake with my, my buddies. But by the time you're watching this, I should be back. I get back on Tuesday. And I think I'm scheduling this video for Tuesday. So uh, by the time you're watching this, I should be back already. But uh, So here we have my first ever Alliance War fight with Omega Sentinel. So we have a man thing here on the vivified node. Um, he is also one of the global defenders. So he's going to get the mystic dispersion as well as his own mystic dispersion, I'm sure, through masteries. So I went ahead and applied the tracking pre-fight first. So boom, double medium, tracking's active. Now, as long as that debuff is active, we can't miss. So we never have to worry about the global. So that's perfect. Uh, go ahead and apply cowardice as well gonna going to also lock that debuff in two with a heavy attack now they're paused trying to bait up the special there we go uh and then gonna go for a light ending combo to pause those then go for uh i'm gonna end this one okay i'm just gonna pause them again i do want to get my heal block off there we go and now i'm gonna go for another combo ending with a light to pause those and i'm gonna throw my special two here i probably should have uh, held on to this a bit because with the vivified as you see he goes to an l3 i did apply an invulnerability boost though so i really like i had that in mind like i wasn't worried you know and i was i was thinking like maybe i can even kill him before that matters but no he, he does go ahead and throw the special here maybe if i tossed my special one i could have killed some more time i don't know um so we do end up tanking this but that's all good Got that invulnerability boost on. Even if we didn't have it on, I feel like we would have been able to definitely survive. We had our 10 armor up, so we'd be pretty tanky. And we throw another special here, and he's dead. So, first time using Omega Sentinel in War, pretty nice. Uh, you know, of course, taking L3 was a little unfortunate, but she, she was crushing that man thing. And, uh, it, dude, I love Omega Sentinel so much. I hope I get to use her a lot more uh, in War. And this season and in future seasons because i i really enjoy playing her and then uh, next up here we have a vision arcus and i already had the vulnerability boost on for the previous fight so i was like perfect i think someone else uh also could have taken this fight but uh like either of us could have but i was like i got the involve boost like set up let's just do it so here just going nuts on the combos uh he gets to a special three I, but i wasn't quite at my special two so i threw it out of phase but doesn't matter when i'm running suicides it hits so hard that it doesn't matter so arcus goes down i didn't have any fights in section two very chillaxed war and then i just have this uh tigra mini boss and i've destroyed rank four tigers here and this is just a rank three so uh yeah i i i, I open this fight and i'm like rank three what this is a baby tiger like this is easy you know it's like if it's not a rank four man honestly like it's a massive confidence boost now because i've already defeated like stronger versions of the same fight so like if i'm facing a weaker version like why shouldn't i be confident as hell you know i already proved that i can do it when it's a rank four so you know rank three is just easy mode um but uh it wasn't able to build up a ton of prowess in that first phase now we move to the poison phase uh, but i'm just gonna throw my special anyways i don't even care uh, it's super hard as well. Again, suicides, man. Like a truck. Got the 200% mutant power back boost. It boosts us to an L3. Throw this, and Tiger's dead. So, very, very simple and easy war for me, which is nice. I think I only use like one item as well, so I went really well. And then I was just moving up to the boss here, and I look. The rank 3 Hulkling. Just a little Hulkling, man. Just a little guy. It's cute. It's cute. Um, being an owner, a proud owner of a rank four Hulkling, which I think you guys have seen by now too. So hell yeah. Uh, this is the current, uh, stats, this war, uh, the current score, we have eight deaths. They have seven, but we only have 11 fights left and they have 59. So look, looks like we're going to win, but you never know. I don't know. The war's not over at this point. Like I said, I'm leaving tomorrow. Um, like before the war ends or like I'm leaving like right as it ends. So yeah, I just wanted to post this video. And yeah, if you're watching this, I should be back now. So yeah, <laughs> thanks for watching, guys. Hope you enjoy. Wrong. I'm going to go for the peace out. <laughs> I'm discombobulated. Drop a like if you enjoyed, and peace out, guys.